brothers, this is your brother G World 7 underscore D chilling. <laughs> I want to make uh, a quick video. I make may another may I may make another video this weekend talking about our history. But man, I'm gonna mention something about our history in this video. Yeah. <laughs> um I said in one of my other videos and I'm gonna say it in this one again. <clears throat> Do not listen to them boule negroes. <laughs> Do not listen to Black Boulet, man. They have done damage and they've been very reckless with our community. <clears throat> they can tell you to tell you go blow, vote blue no matter who. If you look at majority cities, these little Democratic ran cities, run cities, it's nothing but Boulet Negroes bringing them down to the ground. They're ran by Democrats. And this is the biggest races you'll find in these major metropolitan cities where all these boule Negro Democrats are at. Each one of these cities, man, they run down, and the boule Negro has a lot to do with it. All they care about is bragging about themselves, flashing their little clothes and their cars, <laughs> or bragging about the suits and the alligators that they're wearing. Man, these boule Negroes have done nothing. Literally, like I said, I've grown up around them. I'm around them, man. <laughs> and I just laugh at the niggers. I do. They're extremely ignorant. And they continue to, in my opinion, worship Africa. Where most of us are not from. They keep talking about, let's go back to Africa. And that Pan-African stuff. And then you get some of these Negroes who are attacking black men who talked about that Somali woman. Now, I said before, she shouldn't have been hitting the head in the brick. If that's true. And I'm hearing that that's fake. That she you know, shot some kind of little drug up in her damn system. Something up side of her face, man. This chick, man. But I don't believe no man just hit a woman with a brick. But I, we don't need to be sitting there caping. For anyone and everything. I said before, black men, you protect your mother. Your sisters. Your female cousins. Your aunt. Um, your female friends. Your girlfriend, your wife, your daughters, all right? You don't go around caping for just any random woman. You don't know what's going to happen. You have a family to go home to. You should, if you see something going down, you should call the police. But don't always try to come in and jump in that you're going you're gonna to be captain saving. Because you, you never know what's going to happen. And that's not being no wimp or scared. You protect your family. That's who you're supposed to protect. Don't let nobody tell you about being a black man that you're supposed to take any random black woman, particularly a black woman who hates your guts, who talk dirty about you, and who comes from another great group of greater black people. <clears throat> That's insulting. And then we have Negroes and Negresses attacking black men who said they're not going to get down with that. Tells you the mindset of some of our people, male and female, all right? You are pathetic if you don't sit there and try to kick for individuals who hate our guts. And this doesn't apply to all immigrant black folks, but I'm telling you right now, I do not get down with Pan-Africanism because not all black people are African. Not our so-called black people are African. We were already here. But some of you goofy, boule Negroes, you're so ignorant, you have not really studied history, you will to continue to say we come off of some slave ship. You're ignorant. You continue to show you're ignorant, and you continue to show you haven't done no real research. All you clowns want to do is walk around and impress each other and impress white folks. See, I'm just like you, Martha. <laughs> you are a damn joke. You bragging about being consumers. What the hell do you own? Besides being a consumer, buying something for someone else instead of producing and building amongst your own. So I don't listen to boule Negroes, man. Boule Negroes are a big problem in our community. Boule, they always been a big problem, man. Look at man. I, I, I can remember as a kid, man, running in and meeting that old boule rolling birds, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, I just sat there and laughed, man. That Negro wasn't nothing, nothing, man. And then them boule was around him taking his pictures and then talking all that jazz. Well, you can be what he can be. Make it your ass up out of here, man. 
<laughs> I'm telling you, man, these boule Negroes have really, really damaged our people. Because like I said, their main goal is to get pat in the head by white folks. That's their main goal. The boule Negro is a pet and a flunky of the Democratic Party. The Boule Negro, like I said, they said vote blue no matter who. And that's why your major cities, every major metropolitan city is jacked up because you had them Boule Negroes having their hands all up in there. You look at these Negro universities, they still teaching you. Even the Negro ones that you're a slave from Africa, not teach you about the Aboriginal history. They don't want you to know that. Because Negroes don't, uh, not, not only they don't know that, but they don't, <clears throat> they don't want to learn and try to grow and learn and realize that we have a history that's beyond so-called slavery. But the boule Negroes don't want you to hear that. We don't want to upset our white liberal friends. <laughs> Those are friends. See, these Negroes are a joke, man. And it really started to get bad in probably like the mid-60s. When, it started, when these neighborhoods started to shift from uh, white to black. Around 66. And the white folks are totally gone around 73. <laughs> Somebody still stayed. But these little boule Negroes, man. They are the biggest joke that you'll find. These little dumbasses, man. Do not care about our community. Do not care about nothing but themselves. And trying to impress. We're going to have to realize that <clears throat> we can't allow compromised Negroes to speak on our issues. Those are compromised Negroes and Negresses. <laughs> They've been fully compromised. And they cannot speak English. Like I said, I know about them Jack and Jill Negroes, man. I know about the, all these boule Negroes, man. I know about them. They're disgusting. They don't care about the community, man. They don't care at all. All you want to do is just brag. And that's a sad, sad problem with our community. These boule Negroes are stupid and ignorant, man. And they continue to regurgitate the same lie that white daddy and mommy gave to them. So do not listen to the boule. The boule telling you to cape for black folks who hate your black ass. For Negroes who want to sit there and tell you that you're African when you're not. Who want to say everything about your culture comes from Africa when it doesn't. The boule will cape for that. And the boule is telling you now that you need to cape for this... Uh, Ignorant Somalian chick who did not deserve to get a hit brick with her face, which found out she didn't. But the cape for her, she's a black woman, we're gonna, we're gonna stand up for. Hell no. I stand up for black women who are honorable and who are worthy. I do not stand up for trash. Like I said, that woman didn't. If she was hit, which she wasn't, she doesn't deserve that. But the fact is that when boule people try to deflect and attack black men and say that black men are cowards and foreign black men are real, that tells you that those, those are nothing but a coon talking, man. Foreign black men, some of them, and not all. Have been, noticed, have been noted to be very abusive to their women. Now, that's not all. I said some. And for for some of these boule Negroes to sit there and attack black men here. Is a joke, man. They are a joke. They are extremely ignorant, man. But like I said, do not listen to these Negroes. <laughs> they've done. They've having us take the steps, like I said. To hell. These people are ignorant. Stop listening to these boule Negroes. And I'm telling you this over and over again. They're ne you're not going to get anywhere with them. Do not listen to boule Negroes. Peace and love, brothers and sisters.